Hey mom, I really need some extra cash. My rent payment is due in a couple days and my checking account is short. Can you log into your banking app and send me some money? What's your email address? I'll just send the money from my phone. I'll get the tab guys. Just send it to me electronically. Sound familiar? Technology is easing the pain of making payments to friends, kids, coworkers, and many others. You don't need to worry about having cash on hand or wondering who takes checks. But how does it work? Let's take a look at Zelle, one of the few companies making headlines these days. Your bank or credit union may already offer the capability to send person-to-person -person payments via Zelle through their mobile banking app. Note that the service may solely be branded Zelle or a combination of brands. For instance, Chase has branded its service QuickPay with Zelle. If your institution doesn't offer Zelle, you can still utilize the payment service by downloading the Zelle app directly. Once you enroll, all you need to send money is an email address or mobile number of the trusted recipient. Enter the amount you want to send and if that person is enrolled with Zelle, they'll receive the payment in a few moments. If they're not enrolled or using a Zelle enabled bank or credit union, they will receive instructions on how to set it up and receive their funds in a few days. It's also worth noting that some financial institutions offer additional bells and whistles on top of the Zelle app, so some additional features may be bank or credit union specific. Something that easy sure does come with a lot of questions. Here are just a few questions we often get asked about the Zelle Faster Payment Service and what you should know. Who can I send money to with Zelle? Basically, you can send money to anyone you know and trust with a bank account in the US as long as either you or the receiver has access to Zelle through their bank or credit union. How much will it cost me to send a payment? Zelle doesn't charge a fee to send or receive money. However, you should confirm with your financial institution that there are no additional fees on their end. My friend wants to send me money with Zelle. How do I actually get the money? If you're already enrolled, you don't need to do anything. The money will move directly into your bank account in minutes. If you're not enrolled, you'll receive a link to select your bank or credit union with instructions to enroll and receive payment. If your financial institution is not listed, you can download the Zelle app and enroll your Visa or MasterCard debit card. Can I send as much money as I want? If your bank or credit union offers Zelle, you should ask them directly as they may set their own limits. If they do not offer Zelle and you're using the app as a standalone service, your weekly send limit is $500. Can I connect more than one bank account to my Zelle profile? Not yet. Only one bank account can be connected at a time. In fact, if you're having problems enrolling your mobile number, it may already be enrolled with Zelle at a different bank or credit union or with clearexchange.com. I sent the wrong amount. Can I cancel the payment? Most of the time, no. That's why it's incredibly important that you know who you're sending the money to and that you carefully enter the amount. You can only cancel a payment if the recipient hasn't yet enrolled with Zelle. You may do that on your activity page. I don't really know the person I need to pay. Would you recommend I still use the service? Maybe you need to pay someone you just met or are purchasing an item from a buy sell trade site. We recommend you not use this type of service as Zelle does not offer a protection program for payments you make. So. If you use the app to make a purchase, but you don't receive the item, you're out of luck. That was a lot of information in a short period of time, but hopefully you have a better understanding of just one of the many payment apps out there to help you move money safely and securely. If you have further questions, as always, reach out to your financial institution or visit zellpay.com.